Hello, this is a quick instructional video on how to use this Excel sheet for your rental property. So what you're gonna see first is your categories listed over here. It's in alphabetical order and it scrolls up and down for easy navigation. What you want to do is add the amounts to the right of each category. So say for rent collected, you collected $2,000 in rent. Just enter that in and maybe the next month you collected $2,200 in rent and it keeps a running tally over here in this cell and this cell will add all of this up right here and even if you run out of room you could still go over here and add more in it goes out pretty far so even if you add it over here it still changes the number over here and tallies everything up and i try to add every single category possible but if i try to add even more than that this list is going to be way too long so i did include blank areas that for your particular reasons, you might have, say, pool services that you pay $200 for. Just enter that in, it will tally it up over here. If you keep on scrolling down, there will be this part for improvements. And if you hover over this, you will see that it gives you a brief explanation of what this is. If you want something in more detail, just click on it. It will open up a separate link to a web page that allows you to read it in more detail according to the IRS. Just enter in the description of what it was, say dishwasher, enter in the date that you put it in, and enter in the cost. And that's really it. Uh, once you do this throughout the year, you'll get the full totals tallied up over here. Now I do have another Excel sheet that's more detailed for some of my other clients that are more particular with how they keep track of their records. Sometimes they want it done by the month. So this is a second one where there are tabs per month for each corresponding month. And then this tab right here will just add every month up and give you the total over here. You can find this at our webpage and there is an instructional video for it as well on our YouTube page along with other videos. So please let me know if you have any questions in the comments below. I'll try to answer it all. My job here is to try to make your life a little easier and I hope I did that.